Cover Killer Nation. It's been a long time since you've seen this face, hasn't it? Hasn't it? Why? Because my old channel, which is just entitled Cover Killer, was suspended. Why? Probably for content violation. I'm not exactly too sure. See, here's the downfall of everything, ladies and gentlemen. The downfall, just like the song that I'm listening to by Exodus off of Exhibition B. Uh, Exhibit B, should I say, is that... Really, the downfall is, is that whenever you get your third strike, whenever you hit that suspension point, they really don't tell you exactly what video it was that caused it. You don't get that opportunity to find out. And that, I think, is a real downfall of YouTube. Now, before, whenever I got suspended under another one of my accounts, Porcupine Theater, uh, no, not that one, actually. It was one before that shit. Uh, Son of a light bulb. <clears throat> I kind of had an idea which one it was because I had posted the Philadelphia Phillies winning the World Series. Not exactly a smart idea on my part, but hey, it got me a lot of hits, so fuck it. Uh, I kind of knew that that was going to be the culprit. Uh, this time, it was really kind of unsure because I've been doing nothing but album reviews uh, throughout 2010. And uh, the last one that I did was actually my uh, Dio tribute. So if they got pissed off that I played uh, Holy Diver in the background of that, um, I think that's kind of disrespectful to fucking Dio, since considering he had just recently passed away. May he rest in peace, metal brother. Um, anyways, I am back, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, this is kind of more like an introduction video. And also, I need to talk to you guys one-on-one. -on -one. The members of Cover Killer Nation, I need to know what you guys want. Because I have a query of about a hundred different album reviews that I have saved from uh, the last uh, the last channel. And now, uh, not all of these, I think, I don't have every single piece of album review uh, history that I've done uh, for this channel uh, saved. I think there's a couple of them that uh, never did make it to the save uh, whenever my computer crashed or anything like that. But I, I want to know, I, I want to know, guys, uh, do you want just new reviews? Do you want me just to say ixnay on all that other shit, a eh, and just, you know, keep it off the channel? Or do you want me to kind of bring it back in, like, one by one, kind of as little... You, you know, the angry video game nerd, uh, what he did was, whenever he got suspended, whenever he launched Cinemassacre.com, he would start to bring back some of his old reviews, one by one. That way you guys can remember what he did, and also, like, relive mem uh, parts of that history, and also remember where, you know, where he came from, really, to see the kind of the evolution of the AVGN from inception to current. Uh, would you want me to do something like that, maybe, where I get a couple of those old reviews up there, or do you, would you rather see me do them again, maybe update them, and see if there's anything new that I can offer to them, see if maybe my opinions shifted a little bit, because if you remember, I had a lot of different accounts, or excuse me, a lot of different playlists going on, I had 2010 album reviews, I had regular album reviews, I had classic album reviews, Forgotten Gems, I had Opeth in one big, uh, playlist of its own, I had Tool in one of its own, I was going to have one for Porcupine Tree, and for Death, and for a couple of other bands, you guys had tons of requests, tons of requests, so I just want to know what you guys really want to think about, uh, what you think about all this, and, and do you want me to do that, and maybe, you know, spread the good news that way, by bringing some of the old ones back, or do you want to see me redo them, now I will say this, if you want me to redo them, it is going to be something that's going to be very time consuming, and I'm not going to have nearly as much time, considering I'm getting a lot more hours. But you know what? That's okay. Whatever you guys want, because you know I'm also going to be doing something else. Now, there's a lot of other people in the album review community which you should all subscribe to. If you are new, if you just came and met Cover Killer right now, there's a lot of guys in the album review community that you need to subscribe to. Sir All About Music, Jumble Junkie Music, Vision and the Voice, The Needle Drop, Dream Sequencer 08, 666 Rock Superstar, JTG Sound, Yak Sniffer, Danny Dumbass, there's... Uh, the irate music uh, reviewer. There's a lot of people out there that do this. This is a great and strong community, and you guys can be a part of it, too. But um, a lot of them have also been on blog TV. And I, for one, have not done a blog TV. I uh, did a blog talk radio back in October that had, I think, a total of two people on it. I'm thinking about doing a blog TV. Cover Killer is over on blog TV. Cover Killer is the name. And... I don't kind of want to get a gauge of how many people would be there for this blog TV. Now, I just have one thing left to say to you guys, and if you guys are watching this video, you guys are probably former subscribers to the Cover Killer account. Become subscribers to the Cover Killer Nation account, for one. And for two, tell everybody that perhaps found out about the channel from you. Spread the word that Cover Killer is back and reviews are here. They are coming there's a lot of big releases that I can go over. There's a new Stone Temple Pilots. There's a new Smashing Pumpkins. A new Soulfly. There's a new Pain of Salvation. 
Nevermore's coming out. We got tons of stuff to talk about, guys. Let's get to it. Tell everybody that Cover Killer is back, and he is ready to dominate YouTube once again. Take care, guys.